want to teach y'all. I want to teach y'all some principles. By the way, we're a little off schedule, and we're we're gonna end up a little late tonight. How many y'all okay with that? Say I'm okay. Okay. But I'm, I got some principles I'm gonna show you now. How many of you? I mean, I just gave away $145 or something like that, $35, something like that. I don't remember. $136. How many of y'all would like to see me give away, say, $400 more? Okay. Okay, now, I'm going to teach you a principle. If you're going to become wealthy, you cannot become wealthy by yourself. I'm a pretty smart guy. And I've had some unique experiences in my life. You know, I've had $6,000 weeks. But you know what I found out? I've had $20,000 a week. Here's what I found out. It's easier to make $20,000 a month than it is to make $20,000 a year. It's easier to make $20,000 a day than it is to make $20,000 a week. Wow. It's easier, everybody say easier, to make $20,000 in an hour than it is to make $20,000 in a day. This is not something that I heard somebody say. This is what I know by my own experience. I've done it all. I mean, I've done all those things I just mentioned. I've made a quarter of a million dollars in 45 minutes. And here's what I know. It's a lot easier to make a quarter of a million dollars in 45 minutes than it is to struggle for a whole month to do it. <laughs> that's what I was saying. I'd like to have that struggle. <laughs> By the way, I'm going to teach you how to make a million dollars this morning. I'm going to teach you, I'm going to teach you a formula. But see, if I teach it to you, and you got all these pennies in front of you, you ain't going to get it. So I'm still moving pennies. Everybody okay with me moving pennies? Say, I'm okay. Now, so what I want you to understand is this. You're going to have to surround yourself with like-minded people. What kind of people? You're going to have to choose a millionaire team. You're going to have to get them all on the same page. Great question. What is your name, sister? Amanda. Give it up for Amanda, y'all. That, that is a great question. And I think the answer... I think the answer is that there are other people in your area that are on the same page. You just haven't found them yet. I think that's one answer. But I think if not, if you, until you find somebody from that area, find somebody in another area you can do teleconferences with. Like Dr. Fran and I have partnered on this event. She lives in Texas. I live in Pennsylvania. Okay, so the person doesn't have to be in your area, but because of telephones and because of the internet and because of airplanes, we all live close together now. And so did that help you? Excellent. Thank you for the question, though. Great question. Now, what I'm going to do is I'm going to show you how to get everybody on the same page. I wrote a book. How many of you have ever read my book, The Ebony Treasure Map, The Roadmap to Riches for African Americans? Raise your hand nice and high if you've read my book. How many of you have not read my book? Excellent. Here's what I'm going to tell you. One of the keys that I did, see, when I first got started in the game, I wasn't surrounded by people like-minded to me. But now I'm surrounded by people like-minded to me. Why? Because as I read something new where I learned a principle, I remember when I first read Robert Allen, Mark Victor Hansen's book, The One Minute Millionaire, I, um, I was so impacted by it that I went out and bought 20 copies at $20 a piece and gave them to my closest friends and family. Now here's what happened. Some of them actually read the book. Some of them didn't. But I will give you a book. I'll give somebody a book. I will not come by and read it to them. I mean, I understand the difference. Okay. So, what happened, out of the ashes of poverty, began to rise around me a team of people that became successful. And now I've got people I can bounce ideas off of. And even if I sow a seed into somebody's life by giving them a book, or better yet, selling them a book, that's better than giving them one. You selling somebody one of my books, or one of somebody else's books, one of Dr. Fran's books, or one of Stephen's books, is better than you giving it to them. How many of y'all want to know why? Say why. why. Because number one, they need to invest the money so they read the book. That's one reason. And number two, you need the practice at selling. How many of y'all got it? Say, I got it. Here's what I found out. The more you sell, the better you get at it. I'm real good. Oh, I got crazy selling skills. I could teach y'all some things about selling. In fact, I'm going to create a course called The Art of Selling Without Selling. It's, it's amazing. Now, but I don't have time to go into that right now. I may go into it a little bit later on. Here's what I'm going to do. I've got a couple of books over there for those of you who are serious about becoming a millionaire. Now, my book sells for $20. In fact, I'm going to grab one. I'm going to grab one, and I'm going to share with you some of the principles um, out of this book. Now... 
I wrote this book. I wrote this book. It came out August 29th, 2006. I had a lot of people trying to talk me out. Why you want to write a book for black people? Don't you know black people don't read? <laughs> okay, I'm writing it anyway. Aren't you scared that people are going to pigeonhole you as the black person's wealth created? Hey, that is not my concern. My concern is to share the principles that I've learned. Yeah, all y'all got it in the bag. That's your copy. Now it's time for you to empower your team. How many y'all ready to empower a team? By the way, Dr. Yeah, yeah, how many y'all ready to empower a team? Say, I am. See, Dr. Fran and I, we, she and I, have invested a lot of money out of our pockets. What's up? To put this on to empower you. I mean, we wrote some big checks. And we're cool with that. That's okay. That is not a problem. That's a beautiful thing. But see, here's what I under, and you may wonder, well, why are y'all putting on this black millionaire summit? Why are y'all investing your money out of your pocket to put on? Here's why. Because here's what we understand. We understand, first of all, the, the principle of infinite abundance states that number one, there's more than enough for everybody to have more than enough, and there'd still be more than enough left over. That's first and foremost. Secondly, we understand that the better each of us do, the better all of us can do. And if we empower you to become more wealthy, then we automatically become more wealthy. 